Phoenix Suns with the 22nd pick. They are one of two teams to be granted a workout with Bronny James. Bronny James, according to reports, has declined workouts with virtually everybody except for the Lakers and the Suns, according to Sham Sharania on FanDuel TV. What do you think about this plan for the Suns, Kyle? Are they in the right to be angling for Bronny James and a trade or signing for LeBron? It makes you wonder what the thinking is. Like, is it, if it were a pride thing about like Bronny is actually good and we're going to prove it to you, you would think they wouldn't be declining any kind of invites. And they've probably shifted from over the past year to just like, screw you guys. We're going to go where we want to go. I understand all that. Um, it just seems, you know, if LeBron were 32, which the math there wouldn't add up for having an you know an eighteen year old son, but like if he if LeBron were, uh, <laughs> I mean it could it could, <laughs> uh, but I'm just saying uh, if if LeBron if we if if like what was on the line was like maybe even a like close to post prime LeBron uh, year or a couple years, I would think about it honestly. I really would think about it because I think I think the fogginess of him as a prospect would be definitely worth that if you were a, a Phoenix. Um, I don't know. It doesn't seem very realistic. We had some wise people tell us that it's maybe not in play, that maybe he's in play with them, but not at that pick. Um, so what was the other team other than Phoenix you said? What was the Lakers or was it? The Lakers. Yeah. The Lakers yeah. and the Suns. And that's it. Sham said he had 10 workouts scheduled and he canceled all of them except for the Lakers and the Suns. I mean, I, I'm intrigued by the idea of Bronny James being drafted by the Suns, whether it's with the 22nd pick or in a second rounder that they buy or acquire on draft night, because if you're Ishbia and you're that front office, your pitch to LeBron is like, hey, you got the old guy Avengers with Kevin Durant together. You guys finally get to be teammates. Uh, we'll bring back Chris Paul. <laughs> God, <laughs> well, uh, well, uh, well, we we'll got issues your already, but yeah, we'll, we'll we'll bring in your son and Bradley Beal. I'm sure would be very happy to waive his no trade clause to go to the Lakers. Would the Lakers want to take on Beal's contract for LeBron to opt into his option and get traded to the Suns? I don't know. Would LeBron actually want to leave LA for Phoenix? Maybe I've thought about it. The lower state taxes <laughs> sure do look great. I like Phoenix. Phoenix is nice. Um, so <laughs> I had a think, good meal I think down from, there. All right. Yeah. 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 I mean, I, <laughs> I like Phoenix. Arizona's nice. I, I drove years ago, you know, to Arizona's campus after doing some stuff on the Suns, and that drive there is beautiful through the desert. I like Arizona. So I could see the appeal for LeBron. You're a short flight away to LA. I could see it being an appealing option for him, especially if the Suns Ishbia. Like, this is on brand, isn't it? it These is. big swinging moves. Like, this is who Ishby is trying to be. And by the way, LeBron solves a lot of their issues that they had this past season. Offensive. I know defensively he does. Offensive, yes. Yes. Defensive, they would. I, I, ideally, if I'm the Suns, what I'd want to do is with the 22nd pick, draft Missy, mm. lob threat, interior defender, versatile center. Get Bronny in the second round, trade Beal for LeBron, sign Chris Paul to a league minimum, and go try to win the championship. That's what I would try to do. Yeah, they're gonna they're gonna create a lot of like problems for themselves. Or Igadaro is an interesting guy for them to play, but they'd still be small. Um, yeah, uh, offensively that team would be incredible. Actually, if they added Igadaro, that or that'd be just really fun to watch. I think. Well, that'd be nice. I like Igadaro for them too. Yeah. 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 It just it just creates a lot of problems. If Ishbia does this, it just kind of reminds me of somebody who lost on a bet and he just keeps betting and just going further and further <laughs> into the red, you know? Like, uh, so I, I it it makes me nervous. Um, I don't know. I doubt it happens, but could live to see myself be wrong about that. 